Uh, Down the Bray TV, Portland Park, uh, Darvo run out 2 0 winners. Uh, v Troon, just give us your thoughts, Mick. Uh, really professional performance, to be fair. I thought we were excellent for the full 90 minutes. I, I, I don't remember, apart from maybe. Troon missing a header in the first maybe couple of minutes after a set play. I, I don't, Chris has not got a safety mate. I don't think there's been, they've created any opportunities in the game, even though they were stuffy and, and worked hard. And you're always worried about their qualities at times, obviously. Steve Watt front and Stephen Wilson, players like that, they're very top, top players at this level. But I thought we were excellent all game and created some really, really good opportunities. Some of our football was outstanding. And listen, I don't think anybody would deny we fully deserve to win the game. Their goalkeeper put off three or four really outstanding saves, so we were excellent. Uh, felt, felt, uh, the players uh, disciplined did quite well. I thought there's a couple, couple of challenges for the man in the middle. A couple of decisions should have saved the man in the middle at the end. It could have been quite easy. Could have went one way, but players remain disciplined. Uh. Aye, listen, it's hard. It's, listen, it's, it's a difficult job for referees at this level, or any level to be fair. I, I, I think you know me by now. I felt I don't go on their backs because it's such a hard job as well. And they, they, the thing with this game at this level as well, it's played at such a frantic. Sp- uh, the pace as well so but listen the, really happy with the performance happy to get three points got a wee bit of momentum behind us now I always felt when we started to get some people back that we would start to get a bit of settled shape and a bit of structure about us and you can see that in the performances now and then hopefully the next couple of weeks we'll start to get maybe another three or four really important players back and, and we'll see how the season goes for there and obviously getting a bit of momentum. You talk about obviously getting a few players back. What is the latest with him, Matt? Uh, Murray was training Monday, Wednesday. He'll come back in maybe Monday. Next week he'll come far too early for him, but he's no far away. Ross Codwell's maybe 10 days away, two weeks away. Uh, obviously, Willie Robertson, I think, season uh, potentially is finished. He'll not find out an update until March. Cam Eden went in for an operation on Thursday, so he's no far away. Galt, he's maybe 10 days, two weeks away. So... Uh, but we're nearly there, we're nearly there. Still really five, six really important players missing, but uh, hopefully they'll be back pretty soon. Yeah, and uh, felt obviously great for confidence today as well. Obviously we defended excellent today and, and great to see the goal shared out with your, your two centre-halves. Uh, two, two, two set plays. Two, f- you, you think the amount of opportunities we created in open play and you scored for two set plays, two great deliveries for Darren, two, two aggressive feeders for centre-halves. But uh, listen, you're always going to be asked to defend at this level at times. It's, it's really aggressive level of football. Uh, sometimes it's really direct, so your centre-halves are asked a lot of questions. But I thought, I thought we were excellent. I the back three were outstanding. I think... Since Craig Veed's come in, he's been absolutely top drawer every game. He's been a fantastic signing. Uh, it, it, just, it was just a, it was a really good professional performance, and all we can ask for is three points and move on to next Wednesday. And that's it on Wednesday night, obviously, the biggest game of the season so far. Some would say, obviously, against uh, Auchinleck. I see that they've obviously picked up points today against Fairlawford. <laughs> team that, that, that I don't think they're, they're undefeated so far we, we've got to go and take a game to them and, and hopefully we can make it work Wednesday Aye right, listen I, f- I think obviously he's not me buying out the club I think we'll go there and be attacking and we'll try and dominate the ball and win the game I don't think anybody's doubting the task in front of us they're a fantastic side great experience they're themselves on a really really good run as well to be fair so it'll be, it'll be a really really good game two good sides uh, Purely for the fans, it was a good spectacle. And we'll go down there and try and win the game. We'll just need to obviously see what the outcome is after Wednesday, but it'll certainly not be an easy task. Uh, and But as I said to you, you need to concentrate and win the points run about. Everybody's so focused on Auckland Lake, and we are all focused on who switch some calls Wednesday. But you've seen that through a wee period there, I know picking up points, you end up a distance away from them, and you, you need to win the other games as well. But, but again, listen, the game's new here. We'll go there, it's my first game going there as a manager, so I'm really looking forward to it. It's a fantastic ground, fantastic occasion. And uh, I think it'll be a really good game of football. Good for then. I am. <laughs> I'm sure they'll give me a really nice welcome, to be fair. I'm sure they will. Uh, and the, uh, in the last few games as well, Mike, how important has it been to have a settled 11? I know there's maybe been the odd change between the last three games. Do you think that's been a key? You can, well, I, I don't think you can. Uh, I, I, I think any manager would tell you that you can't. You can't put a price on how important that is to get a bit of continuity. And uh, the problem you've had is we've been changing four and five and six every week, and it's impossible. And also within that, you've got boys playing out of position, really unusual positions at times as well, to try and plug gaps. So it's hard. But I always felt when we got a bit of continuity back, we got a bit of some of the boys back fit, and we could get a bit of structure about us. And a wee bit of same sort of nine, eight players every other week. Then I think we would be a wee bit stronger for it. And I think we've seen that in the last couple of performances. Well done. Three points and up the road. Not Wednesday. Cheers, Cheers mate.